Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do the first video of the college series series video. One of my subscribers said um, to talk about self-esteem and confidence. I know like it's normal to have, especially as a girl, to have like self-esteem and confidence, pro confidence problems, you know. Especially like in your teenage years, maybe even your early 20s, and sometimes beyond. I think to an extent we all have those days when we don't feel too cute or don't feel too great about ourselves, including myself. In high school, um, I know it's like a, and in college too, it's like a big popularity contest. Um, and not just even high school and college, we're not even going to limit today. In the, like, if you work somewhere in a workforce or anywhere with, with a bunch, where a bunch of girls are, it's like competition for some reason. And, um, it's, it's just how it is. There comes your self-esteem problems. Like in high school, your life is like, it's like a popularity contest. Um, you want to be a part of that popular cl clique so bad. Once you, like, grow up. And you experience different things and you experience the world you gonna realize like it's more to life than just that high school stuff i know right now high school maybe like maybe even in college it's like your life will revolve around a certain thing but i promise you once you experience the real world once you get out of your on your own and you stand on your own two feet your your priorities gonna change things gonna change change it's like it's a whole life ahead of you um, besides high school and college. It's like All I can tell you really is to um, think positive. To um, boost your self-esteem and have more confidence in yourself. Just think positive. Have self-talks with yourself. You know, um... Put up this stick and don't say mirror. Say you are beautiful. To, you are beautiful. You are intelligent. Um, you are a good person. And um, don't just focus on the outside stuff like you're pretty, your clothes are nice or whatever. That might be true, but focus more on the inside. You'll feel better about yourself if you focus more on the inside versus the outside. So you can put like this stick and don't say I am a good person or. I volunteer here every week or I love children or such and such some positive aspect about yourself of course focus on the positive don't focus on the neg negative because I am a big big believer in karma and I believe the energy you put out into the world or the things you do or the actions or the words you speak constantly that's that's what you're going to get back I believe if you do good, good things come. If you do bad, bad things come. Karma does not necessarily have to be a good, bad thing. Whatever energy you put out, whatever thought process you had, have, it will come to be. Don't let people know you're intimidated because once they know it's like, you know, waving meat at a lion, they will pounce on you and they will take full advantage of that um, intimidation. So don't, don't do that. A lot of things about how you feel about yourself have to do with society and people feed into society a lot like the media you may think a certain look is pretty or beautiful or whatever you may think a certain style is pretty and beautiful and maybe you can't afford it or you just don't look like that and you probably will never look like that in your lifetime and play into it because I know like being a chocolate girl in my younger days, a lot of people don't ask rather they don't like dark skinned girls. And they don't date light skinned girls or Spanish or white girls. Or somebody was asked a dark skinned black girl, if they did a black girl at all. It used to bother me, but now, as I got older again, just don't care. I figure if you don't like it, somebody else gonna like it. Cherish it and love it. So just don't dwell on it, cause some of the same guys that said that back when you was in high school or whatever. Or maybe in college, once they hit, like, they get to, like, they from our mid-20s or whatever, they, they ideas go to changing. Like, what you like or what you think is beautiful or whatever in your 
you know, 10 years, it's going to change over a period of time. I can't tell you how much I change in a period of every three years I have evolved. It seemed like it to me. I started noticing my evolution, um, how my thought process and, um, about things, uh, my outlook on life. I started noticing it changing around like about 21, 22 years old. So, you know, what you feel about yourself come from the male perspective. Um, just know males are, um, like, males are dumb, like... Especially at a certain age, like some guys never grow up. I could be like 40 years old, act like they're 15. Some guys never ever grow up. So don't look to a guy to validate yourself. Like, don't be that female that only feel good about yourself when you get a compliment for from a guy. When you look in the mirror or you know things about yourself that no other people know. Like, you should automatically feel good about yourself. Never look to anybody else for your happiness. Look for yourself. Uh, look within yourself for your happiness. Date you for a while. Just be your own boyfriend. Be your own girlfriend. Whatever you want to be. Be, the, be that. Be your own date. Once you do that, I believe, like... You 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 will find yourself worth. You know what makes you happy. You know how to make yourself happy. Um, you know what you will tolerate, what you won't tolerate. Um, be yourself. Honestly, just be yourself. Don't try to be anybody else. Don't try to be the popular girl. Don't try to be the your favorite musician. Don't try to be your favorite YouTuber. Like, don't just be whoever you are. Please surround yourself around positive people because don't have a friend that's constantly, y'all don't know these people that constantly um, want to tear you down. They're envious or jealous of you, which may what you have or maybe of how you look or just your abilities. They're jealous of it. They want to constantly tear you down. Keep, them, keep you in the same spot there and they get mad when you go above them. So surround yourself around positive people because people around you do indeed affect affects your confidence, confidence and self-esteem and when you have um people around you that are constantly positive rooting for you I always good job or you will do better next time just keep trying it you're smart you're intelligent you will you can do this just focus more when you have people telling you that versus um versus be like um you can't do that you ain't smart enough you're not pretty enough for that or like you see the difference, like, if you constantly have people telling you negative stuff out the time, you're going to feed into it and you won't do anything. You won't go after anything. You just feel down and bad about yourself because they feel that way. So they try to um make you feel that way, like, wait, like, misery loves company. Those users and, um you know, the people just only call you when they need something or just need to go out. But if you need to study for something or maybe you're in a jam, they can't help you. Just get rid of those type of people because I'm telling you, if you keep those people in your life, like just constantly call you when they need something or just call you when they need to go, you know, they want to party or whatever, you will start feeling bad about yourself. You'll be like, I can't believe I let somebody manipulate me, but manipulate me like that all the time. And you start feeling bad about yourself. You start thinking, what's wrong with me? And that can help. That can, um, mess with your self-esteem if you do that so just cut those people that that's your life you will find a new friend eventually the key is positive positivity positive 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 thoughts positive people positive environments um <clears throat> have positive talks about yourself look look within yourself and um and Pinpoint all the positive things about yourself. I believe there is something good in everybody. I think everybody has some positive about their self, no matter who the person is or what you have done in the past or what you have tolerated in the past. I know it can be hard sometimes to be positive, but you know, even if you got to do it through music, go and download you some positive songs. Get involved in activities um, make you feel positive about yourself. Go and volunteer for an organization. Or try to get a job, maybe, that make you help, make you feel positive about yourself. Read positive books or whatever. If you're really into your religion, you could read spiritual books or religious books um, relating to self-esteem and confidence. Um, I know Oprah on her own network is a lot of things about you know self-esteem and confidence. To boost mind, just, you just have to be positive all the time. Be weary who you let in your circle um, of people. 
you know, have those self-talks. Remind yourself of the great person you are, what you have accomplished in life. And, you know, if somebody doubts you, you tell them, you know what, I have worked hard for this. Um, or I have came a long way from, from where I once was. I mean, if you haven't made it there yet, be like, you know, I'm trying to become this person. And I really don't need all the negative energy in my life. And I don't need you saying this and that. So if you if you want to be that way, I just prefer not to be around you. I hope this video was beneficial to you. And this is the first of hopefully more videos. And again, if you guys have any more ideas you want me to talk about. Relating to college life, high school life, academia, social life, whatever, just um, you know, any topic you want me to talk about, just list it in the um, comments below or you know, um, send me a message on um, YouTube, inbox me on YouTube. You can do that. But anyway, thank you guys for watching this video and remember to stay positive. Don't let anybody bring you down. Just have those self talks. And if you have to put up sticking those all in your mirror, remind yourself you are a great and you are an awesome and amazing person. All right, you guys. Um, don't forget to comment, like this video, and please subscribe. All right, you guys. I will see you guys another time. Bye bye.